Hi, I will show you an easy way to download textures, 3D meshes, statical meshes, skeletal meshes, whatever you want from Unreal Engine project. Okay, in my example, I will, uh, I will take a texture, modify the texture and re-import it back to Unreal Engine. Okay, so I think I will take this flag. Okay, so this flag, I will take it and I will change the color of the skull in uh, red, for example. Okay, so let's start. So let's find the texture. Okay, this is uh, the folder where is the texture for this flag. Let's open it. And I want to export this texture in PNG format so I can modify it in Photoshop. There is no direct way to export this to PNG from Unreal Engine, but I will show you a very simple method so you can export not only texture, but whatever you want from Unreal Engine. Now, Google UE Viewer. Okay, I will put the link in the description so you can directly access it. Okay, and here you will have to download a very small program. Click on Win32 version and save it on your desktop. Okay, the file is on the desktop. Let's extract the zip. After the extraction, you just have to open the folder and open the executable file. There is no installer, okay? Just a very simple executable file, as you will see now. Now, you have to select the path to your project. How you will do that? It's very simple. To your library in Unreal Engine, see the project that you are working on, and after that, show in folder. Here, what you will do, you will have to select the upper bar and copy the address. Just copy the address. Now, you will go back and paste the address in this location. Now, what you will have to do, you will have to select what you want to extract from Unreal Engine. In my case, I just want the texture, nothing else. And that's it. I will give it um, nothing, nothing to select, just what is on the screen. And after, I will give it an OK. You will have to wait a bit. This program will scan your project for whatever you selected. In our case, we'll search for textures. OK, it's done. I will just bring the window here and I will search for my texture. In order to find the exact texture that I want, I will go back to Unreal Engine. Okay, as you can see here is the content of the whole project. Let's go back to Unreal Engine. In the Unreal Engine, in my content, I will search for this flag texture. Let's see, I think it's in textures, clothes, cloth, and I think uh, I found it. Yes, it's this one. Okay, so just to see the address where it is, I want to export this to PNG file. Okay, let's go back to our little program. Okay, back in UE Viewer, we will find the exact texture that we want to download. And is this. Okay, these three uh, textures are also, there is normal map and everything. I will take all of them and click export. A new window will appear and I want the texture format to be exported to a file. Okay, I will create a new folder on my desktop. I will name it textures. Okay, that's it. And I will, very important, here I will select PNG. Okay, selecting PNG, all the texture will be export it to a PNG and that's it. You will click OK. Now the texture will export it. You can hit cancel here and you can exit UE Viewer. Now let's open our textures. Export it already. Okay. 
and that's it you have the texture in png file okay i want to modify this texture so i will import it to photoshop and let's paint this skull in red now we'll export from photoshop to png okay i will replace the old file and that's it now i want to import it back to Arial. Back to Arial, I just right click, reimport with the new file path, and I will search for this new texture. Now I will click open, and that's it. This is how you import the texture from Arial Engine, modify it, and send it back, import it to Arial Engine. In this way, you can do the same with the 3D meshes, sounds or whatever you want from Arial Engine. Okay guys, thank you for watching. Bye.